This is for Libra. A pop-up read for Libra. Hmm. Cute, the devil. Be interesting to know why this devil is here, or is it Capricorn? Libra, please. Sorry about the lighting. I'm moving. I'm not replacing these lights. They're too expensive. And I'm moving, so not my problem. King of Pentacles. Seven of Wands. One more card, please, for Libra. Queen of Wands in the star, healing, having faith, being patient, the stars aligning. Didn't we get that, or was that Taurus got that last one? Why is the devil here? We're all curious to know why does the devil keep popping up for us? Why is the devil here? Is it Capricorn? Is it the devil? Something about letting go. Letting go, they keep saying, letting go. The devil, please. <sighs> yep, walking away. Holding back. Fusing. Why is the devil here? The emperor. No, oh, the this emperor that loves Libra is holding back because he is still bonded somehow to this devil energy. He's, he's walking away from it though. This toxic situation that he was in. He's sad, very sad. This Taurus or this Taurus or Aries. There's communication coming in though. Page of Pentacles. He will be offering a date. This King of Pentacles. This Capricorn Virgo or Taurus. He will be making an offer. He wants abundance with Libra. Why is the Page of Pentacles here. You know, in some decks, the Page of Pentacles means abundance. A windfall of, of abundance. The, the Page of Pentacles means that. Death. Why is a death card here? Aw, he wants to transform this. There it is, the Pentacle, Ace of Pentacles. He's going to make an offer of stability. Of a relationship. Why is the seven of wands here? Why is the seven of wands here? For Libra. Struggling over the burden of the broken heart. Three of swords here. Seven of wands. Libra's being a good girl, waiting for her ships to come in. Why is the queen of wands here? Queen of Wands, please.
Knight of Wands, Queen of Cups. One more card, please. I'm left-handed, so I do everything backwards. Let's see here. Queen of Swords. So Libra wants to express her feelings and passion to this person that she loves. She's waiting patiently. For her ships to come in to get out of this broken heart so that the burden can be dropped. Dear Heavenly Father, do you have any advice for Libra? Keep your back turned. Don't ever look back, he's saying. Going in a new direction. Leap of faith. Oh, my days pentacles again. All your power, the lovers. <sighs> Chariot and the tower. Oh boy. Ten of wands on the bottom. Saying, take a leap of faith to what makes you happy. That to restore peace, you need to take a leap of faith towards the Ten of Cups. What makes you happy? Just focus on what makes you happy to get out of this illusion of everything that was unsuccessful and uns unfulfilled, all your heartbreak and sorrow. And then once you do that, once you start focusing more on your happiness, the Ace of Pentacles is going to come in, the Lovers and the Chariot. And then that's what's going to cause this tower here. Because it's going to happen abruptly, he keeps saying, abruptly, abruptly. It's just going to be like bing, bang, boom. The big bang is coming. A good one.
see here. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here? says it's coming, it's dangling there, it's ready to be fulfilled. It's just waiting so that nobody um, acts on impulse. So when, you, when your money starts coming in, save it. Don't, don't spend it because it's there. Just wait. The devil. Why is the devil here? Why is the devil here? Everybody to hold so nobody acts on impulse. So make sure you do research on everything that you want. That it's going to fulfill you and make you happy. That's what these illusions are. These good illusions he's saying. Why is the devil here? Oh, jeez. Come on. Justice. King of Cups. Pisces. That the heartache is an illusion, too, that the devil tried putting everybody in. Page of coins again. I guess everybody's going to be having a really nice Christmas. Hmm? Four of Wands on the bottom. You need to take all your inner strength to get out of this Eight of Swords. You need to just, no matter what, turn around and focus on yourself to get out of this broken heart. That it is, there was some voodoo dolls that people had. Everybody forgot about the voodoo dolls. So all those had to be broken too, the curses on the voodoo dolls. But there's some trickery with the voodoo dolls that people didn't know what they were doing either. Um, that was attached to some people's happiness and wealth and stuff like that so once all that energy is done being conflicted and broke then the feelings and the offers and the happiness and everybody coming together with their family and loved ones and soulmates then all that conflict and struggling will turn into people being happy and helping the, the five of staffs will be people helping one another instead of fighting with one another. And it's going to bring a tower to everybody. That everybody is just going to start thinking and seeing more clearly now. To not worry about the devil energy anymore. That he has no grip or anything on anybody anymore. Mm -hmm. 
voodoo dolls. Closing oracles for Libra, please. All this fighting, this cause all over all this witchcraft that is still being healed. So once that takes place, then everybody can start moving forward and get out of their head. They can start celebrating with one another and come together and work together so that everybody can walk through their door, have their you know, their 11-11, their stability at home, their happy fulfillment at life and work. And that's going to bring in the 10 of ten of coins. And it's going to cause a big power once all this negative energy is done being released. It's going to be a big turnaround for everybody. Closing oracles for Libra, please. Mindful wisdom, create inner harmony. Awakened spirit, desire to change. Birth of creation, potential growth. Closing oracles for Libra, please. Opossum. Strategy, fact finding, curiosity. What a dream. That Libra was the bear right now and Tar Taurus was the opossum. It's a weird dream. I don't know. It was like a night or two ago. Closing oracles, please, for Libra. Disruption. the calm before the storm justice and balance I'm just saying there's some kind of restriction still going on I just love this card I can't watch, stop looking at these stars sparkling on this card I don't know why but it's probably my favorite star card in all the decks so far <laughs> 